and welcome back so i've had a few people ask me on the buzz tv remotes this is for the the 100 remote that they have there i think it's the bt 100 um yeah if you guys are interested make sure you guys do check the description below i always leave links to this stuff and if you guys are wanting a hookup i have a coupon code down there so make sure you guys do get all set up um so here it is this is their buzz tv remote and i gotta tell you it works pretty nice um now with the remote it does have a tv source um well it has the tv power button and then the actual source button um to switch to all the different uh, uh ports you do have for the power for the box magnifying glass you got your mute a cursor category favorites um pause play forward uh, rewind uh fast forward record stop all the different servers your vod tv series your your guide pbr is your, your guide your back button your last button info menu up down left right your okay live tv home button guide now this is going to be all geared on just the box itself um, volume up and down channels up and down numbers one through ten pages up and down and then some shortcuts if you want to uh, set it up with specific apps so um on the back of this remote it does have instructions now i'm not going to go and set it up on my tv um, but i'm going to show you guys exactly how to do it so that way you guys could follow along um, so how to program tv or source keys that's going to be these two buttons right up here press and hold the tv and ok button so it's going to be the tv and ok button for three seconds so when you do this you're gonna wait for this light to start blinking just like that. So once that light turns on, that means it's now on um, learning mode. So I guess I shouldn't say blinking, but um, yeah, I'm just gonna hit it again and just let it, right now it's like blinking. So it says press and hold, okay, for three seconds till LED turns solid on and RCU enters learning mode. Press the key to be programmed on this RCU LED begins blinking. So when you push i'm like okay i want this one to be programmed you push it again and it's going to start blinking okay so aim the remote to the front of the of the tv um about three centimeters away press the button on the tv so that's this one that we we're messing up up here if the stb uh is programmed correctly the led will will flash three times then turn solid on so right now it's it's Obviously, it didn't do that because we just left it there. Repeat steps two and three for the other keys. So the other keys will be the source. So it seems like it's pretty easy. Repeat step. Okay, so the five is exit learning mode by long pressing OK button for three seconds. LED flash twice, then turn off. And that should be it. Once you have it all set up, um, then, then you should be good to go. So just follow those instructions. If you have any issues where this remote won't set up with your TV, it might be just an old TV, um, and then you could always reach out to Buzz for help. Now, when you do look at the Buzz device here itself, um, they do have a couple extra features here. So, um, and this is typical for Buzz that they usually do have um, some, like they have like an app for the remote for this one it doesn't though so when you come here and you're searching for it because i know i've done other videos that it does say it has an app this remote doesn't um at least not that i see here um if you go to settings and then come down here towards uh buzz utilities they have a couple options here so system updates home screen weather screen auto frame rate settings and then volume control um, volume control you could force the max if you want um, and then auto frame rate settings again this is just enabling uh, auto framing stuff so if you want to go through this you can i personally will leave it exactly how it is if you don't know what you're doing um you could go into advanced settings and do a couple extra stuff here for some of the the decoders and stuff like that um but as far as this this remote goes there isn't anything specific for it now if you did want to add more remotes you can go to settings and then come down here to remotes and accessories and it's just going to start searching for other remotes so whatever comes up with like bluetooth um you, you could pair other types of remotes here too so this one is just going to be your basic stuff nothing crazy um i know we're always looking for the 
latest and greatest. This one's not going to be with all the crazy features. One more thing too, for more settings, if you come here and then you go to the power key definition, um, for that that power, you could you could either shut down where that's where it's at. You could do suspend or restart. So I would I would recommend shutting it down. If you want to do suspend, you can do that too. That's for that button right there. Um, so that's how you could mess with it a little bit more. Now with these buttons down here at the bottom, these are gonna be for your live TV stuff. So if you do have um, any kind of whatever services that you have here, um, obviously you, the Buzz TV doesn't provide anything like that. You have to get your own service. Um, and then you you plug it in. So these buttons down here at the bottom is going to be for your guide. It'll be like for delete, add, stuff like that. And it'll tell you when you open up the guide what exactly these buttons are for. So pretty simple and pretty basic. Yeah, let me know what you guys think. Um, I didn't want to show you guys how to do this remote on my stuff because my stuff is going to be different from whatever TV that you have. And <clears throat> if you follow those instructions here in the back, it should be pretty close. Um, and again, if you have any questions where it's not working, you might want to ask Buzz, um, shoot him an email, ask him like, hey, this remote's not working with my normal TV. And then they'll ask you for your model and, and what type of TV, you know, make model and all that stuff. And then they'll go through the whole gauntlet and get you all set up. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. Hope you guys appreciated today's episode. As always, you guys take care, take care of each other. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Thank you.